Hey guys, how you doing? Hey. <laughs> yeah, no, I always start the camera weird. I'm just showing you some of the paintings that's in my oldest son's room that I did. Probably kind of hard to see. This was a 14 by 14. He loves black and white. This was a 16 by 20. I did for him. And then we still never gotten around to doing this album clock. We wanted to paint the hands white so we can actually see what time it is. <laughs> but we're gonna do that someday. That's pretty cool. It's so tall up there because it's like a little. And then I did this one over here. I wonder if I can zoom in, hold on. Oh, there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I put these little stones for the numbers right there, see? So anyway, he likes the black and white. Oh, he's got other, all black and white, actually. Like things like this, you know, a deck to the ocean. Another one tree one. And this big old, yeah, I didn't do these, of course. Of course not. Uh, let's see, I did do this one. It kind of looks like a piece of wood. Do I have one behind here? No. So that's his room stuff. So I'm making a D for right here. So, okay, so I got this D that I want to do. It's just a wood D. I got this on clearance. I'm just going to leave that on there. I don't know. Maybe I'll take it off. It gets a little nail on it, so let's go and put that back on. Or I'll just put one of those little teeth hooks on there. So, I did my son one tanner, and then there's the other one. So I'll figure I'm going to do the other one because I found that one today. It's about the same size almost. It's a little bit bigger than this one. This was his. It's been in his room for a long time. I did this a long time ago. And his colors are blue, black, and white. Pretty neat, huh? I like that. So that's Tanner's. <laughs> So I'll put that back in his room. Okay. So I went ahead and resin him. And he looks pretty good. I'll tell you what, the second I put that resin on, it's like the black and the red and white popped. Am I getting a clear picture? Oh, so I originally was gonna have that cobwebbing on. I decided not to. It takes away his looks. What I did notice though is one eyeball kind of slid to the side. <laughs> I was afraid of that, but it's not so bad actually. So then, yeah, I decided not to put the cobweb, keep it off completely. Because I think it actually takes away from the picture. You know, it just did. And because I like all this red up here and I like the red down in here. So I, I want the cobweb hid this right here. Yeah, I'm keeping that off. Anyway, so I put a little resin on the spider. Five spiders. Let's see one big one, another big one. It's 
small one, big one, and small one. That's it. <laughs> so I think it turned out awesome. <laughs> But anyway, I cleaned this with some alcohol just to take off any oils that might have been on there from the store. I actually got this on clearance for $1.97. So I could leave the stickers on there and I'll just put one of those hooks on the back, you know. And I want to catch my uh, things because I want to do some snaps next week. My drippings. So hopefully I got too many bubbles in my white here because I just did this. I just mix this up. Too much black. Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> I'm not even too happy about that. Well, quite a bit because I want to make sure and get the sides real good. I don't not put enough on, you know. I'll do just a little bit there. That's about enough. No more black. Should be like plenty. Yeah, I get to sit down on this one too. That's just nice. Anyway. Okay. Yeah. It's not a good day yesterday. Just trying to do one of those strainer pours. Not working for me. So this I'm using one of my resin racks. Uh, probably clean that off right away because I like to keep it level. Well, it won't make a big deal. Okay. <sighs> now, what's that already? Oh. I hope it turns out good. I didn't pour enough on the first time. That looks cool. But is it enough to get all the sides? I don't know. So, what I'm going to do, I got lots of paint left. Look at that. I have to find something. I'm just going to touch the spots that it's not dripping down to help it. Like you would, you know, your vase. Before you do vases, it's always good to put coat of your whatever color to help the paint go down. good. It's not going to stay that way though. <laughs> yeah. I want to get too much off. I don't want it too thick too. Double check this 
guys. It looks good. I like it a little bit more over here, though. This is not so thick. Cool. That's gotten some cells like selling up in there. Look at that, it's pretty cool. Am I getting a clear photo? That's cool. So we'll let that sit for a minute and then we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm probably not going to do much. Uh, I want to torch it because I don't want it to get specky. So it's not. A whole lot of black as much as I wanted but I'm liking the movement that's going on so I'm leaving it alone so hold on it's okay so it looks cool when I just blow on it little white specks pop up so I'm not even gonna torch it it may develop some more cells but I like it Kinda wish I had a little more black, but it's okay. He'll dig it. It'll look good in there. Okay, so I'm gonna set this aside here. I have a quote here. I'm thinking this week what I'm gonna do is like do you know advice from quotes for the rest of the week, probably till Friday. Even though it's Tuesday now, so but well, what time? What's the date? Now it's Wednesday. Cause it's late. Okay. Okay. This <laughs> is I got it. It's cute. Well, I don't know if you can see it, cause it's all smeary. But look at that cute little porcupine. It's cute. So I picked the porcupine one this week or today. I don't know why, cause I liked it. There's a lot of advice from different animals and stuff. It's cool. We'll have fun with them. Advice from a porcupine. Spend time in the woods. Remember your good points. Have a gentle spirit. Don't needle your friends. <laughs> it's okay to be a slow poke. Stay sharp. <laughs> Stick up for yourself <laughs> all right well thanks guys for watching hope you guys had fun i know i took a while today talking again yeah oh well so i'll catch you later have a good wednesday all week ahead of you and i'll catch you tomorrow all right thanks for watching bye bye guys